Welcome to the video where I'll teach you how to implement MetaMask with React Native. So if you go to React Native docs in MetaMask, you'll see there is a possible way to implement it, but it's only for React Native CLI. And if you want to do it in Expo, it's not really straightforward. You have to set some things up and you know, I, I could do a video on that to how to set it up in Expo, but I think approach with Wallet Connect is a lot simpler. And the, he, here they have coming soon a MetaMask React Native SDK, which should allow us to go over these issues and to implement it easily. But for now, it's just not that good we have to install some stuff set it up with expo and everything so what we will do we'll just go with regular expo approach and we'll go with sudo mpx uh, create expo app template expo template blank typescript And here call it MetaMask mobile and now it's creating the project and what we want to do now while this is going on you want to navigate to the cloud.walletconnect.com slash app and if you don't have a account just sign up that's it but what you want to do here is go to the new project and give it the name you want it to have and you'll you'll have the project here I already have it I already created it in MetaMask mobile you go here and uh, for the project ID uh, you copy the ID because we are going to use it you can copy it later when we need it but we're going to need this project ID in order for us to use wallet connect with our react native app so this hasn't finished yet but what we want to do is go to the VS Code when this is done and write the code and we want to specifically tell Wallet Connect uh, to, to just include MetaMask since by default includes a ton of wallets, almost every wallet you can think of. So we want to specifically go with MetaMask and that could be, you know, uh, just too much since here with this uh, implementation we could just go about using metamask and installing metamask react native sdk if you only want to use metamask and if you want to use other wallets you know wallet connect might be the better option but i think if you just want to use metamask uh, this would be better approach but currently it's hard to set it up with expo so we're going to use the wallet connect and now let's navigate to MetaMask Mobile and do code and here what we want to do is go to the app.tsx and just uh, we could remove the whole thing right and here I wanted to import style sheet style sheet text view and pressable from react native we want to import few stuff from wallet connect too so wallet connect modal and use wallet connect modal we want to from wallet add wallet connect wallet connect slash modal dash react dash native and I forgot we also have to install all these dependencies so go to the command line and do sudo mpx expo install and install these dependencies we also want to install this one And here, what you want to paste now is that project ID. So I will paste mine, what I have 
for the project I already created, but you paste uh, yours from, from the wallet connect. And now for, for the, we, we want to have provider met metadata and I have that here. So just copy this code, just pause the video. This is just a template data that you will change based on your app, but currently it's just template and it will work. And what we want to have is export default function app. And here we want to add use wallet connect model hook and properties. So const open is connected address provider is equal use wallet connect model. And we want to install the second part that is required for the this to work. So sudo mpx expo install. And now while that's installing, uh, return to the editor and do const handle button button press. And this will be the function that will be called when we try to connect to the wallet so if is already connected we will return provider dot disconnect so if provider exists we will disconnect and it will open the modal and here we want to render the ui so render view and inside of that you want to have some let's say text wallet connect and below we want to have the address so if we are connected we want to have is connected uh, let's do address and if not uh, no wallet connected and here on pressable we want to have on press property so on press will do handle handle button press from the above and it will okay inside of that we'll also have text and text will be just if it's connected, we'll have disconnect. And if it's not connected, we'll have the connect text on this pressable. And after all that, we want to have wallet connect modal. And we want to add some properties on that too. So uh, here, we want to have property explorer recommended recommended wallet ids and since wallet connect allows many wallets we want to have the uh, this is the id of the metamask wallet it one need, we want to have metamask wallet specifically but if you want to have uh if you want to have any wallet you want you can specify the ids of the wallets you want and the wallets you don't want you will say here so we say all and it excludes all wallets but since we defined metamask id here it will include metamask there and this is the project id so the project id from the wallet connect and provider metadata so that is the info about your app that you will change based on your project okay and for the we also want to have some styles so i prepared that too you can copy it here just pause the video and I will add those styles to the style to the views and text so style equals styles dot container and here we want to have style equals styles dot heading and on pressable 
we also want to have style is equal styles dot uh, pressable margin and okay i got this error okay now when we go through our device and okay i haven't ran anything yet so now let's go to the command line and do sudo npm start and it will start the project and open on the ios and choose the device we want or open on android and here if we go to expo and paste the url of uh, of the project and try to connect Here you will see when when it's done download, downloading. Uh, here, if you try to click connect, it will display MetaMask Wallet. And since this is the simulator, uh, when I click on that, it will try to open it in the browser. So if you want to t test this out, just uh, you will have to use physical uh, device. So. If not, I, I, I'm gonna try here. So just to show you here, if I open, it will try to open it in the browser and address is not valid. So what you want to do is move to your mobile device. So I'm gonna record on my mobile device and I'm gonna add that part of, to the video. So now we are on the mobile device and we wanna open the project that we implemented the wallet connect on so click the project you want to use and now here if we click the connect button and choose metamask it will open the metamask on your mobile device and it will ask to connect to your account and you say connect and it will redirect to your metamask to your application and here you can click disconnect if you want and it will revert so yeah, that's it. That's how you implement MetaMask with Wallet Connect.